Welcome back, everybody. My name is Matt. Today we're playing some MTGO for Praise Oketro. He won the dice roll. Now we're going to keep this hand. Um, my back has been hurting, so you're going to see me like moving around my chair and moving around the microphone um, because I can't sit up and my chair is just god-awful. So we're going to play a land here. Pass, pass, pass. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Let's see what we're up against. Tapped blue white might be blue white cycling. That deck's been going around a little bit recently. We find another white, so we're gonna tap tap anoint our priest. Yep. And pass. Let's see what he gets. Uh looks like Esper maybe control. Yep, looks like Esper control. So we might be in a little bit of problem or run into a little bit of a uh, problem against this deck. And the reason I say that is because we're just not we're we're good at burn we're good against red decks we're not very good against white or black decks so we're gonna play glint's sleeve artisan here it's gonna resolve yep we're gonna create a servo gain a life all right go to combat and it's going to be Settle the Wreckage. I mean, obviously not for another two turns, but Settle the Wreckage is going to be the card that beats us in this matchup. Just, there's nothing in the sideboard I can do against it. So, turn two, search for us, concept for him is really good. We're just going to, with this type of matchup, you just have to pray. And Torrential Gear Hulk, yeah, definitely control. We just have to pray he doesn't hit anything. Fatal pushes our Anointer Priest. Okay, makes sense. Now we can Ixlon's Binding Search for us concept, but I'd rather use that on Scarab God. I have a feeling that's going to be important. Uh, we could play Oketra here and then get either Essence Scattered or... What? Essence Scattered or uh, Censored. So I think it's Visionary Augmenter. Let's just go to combat. We're going to get in 4-3. Oops. Miss, was misclicking on OK. OK. Get in 4-3. Second main phase. We drop Visionary Augmentor. Not Mentor. Mentor. Here comes Sensor. All right. We did play around Sensor, sort of. I'd rather have that censored than Oketra, because Oketra can do us a lot. Except this deck is for sure gonna be running a lot of exile spells. We just we gotta just gotta pray, really. Alright. And he passes. Anointed procession is a very key card for us. So we're just gonna go straight to combat. Get in for three more. Oh, please settle the wreckage. Settle the wreckage can be good for him. It also can be bad for him. Okay, get in for three more. He's down to 13. Do we just play another round, another counter? Anointed Procession and Oketra are just huge pieces for us in this deck. <sighs> I hate control. All right, here's me adjusting because my back is hurting. I am so sorry if you can hear my chair or me moving my mic. Hold on, let me adjust a little bit more. Okay. I'll be moving quite a bit. Um, do we just go for it? Right? Anointed Procession first? I'd rather have that counter than Oketra. Or would I? I don't know. I think I'd rather have actually Oketra. Uh, let's just go Oketra. If it gets countered, you know, whatever. I think Anointed Procession is a bit... Okay. It looks like... I don't know. Here comes Glimmer, probably. Yeah, eh, no. Ah, Vraska's Contempt. Yeah. Things aren't looking good for us. I think we just get blown out in this matchup. Just, they have the sweepers. They have pr all the answers for us. Uh, there's nothing really we can do. I mean, right now we have three damage on board, but it's not going to matter. Desert's Hold is okay. Let's just go to combat. He's one turn off of Torrential Gear Hulk. B3. 
Begin combat. Get in. Four, three. Yep. Get in for three more. We've done the damage to him. It's just... He's, uh, this deck just gets answers. And search... Or turn two for search for Ozkanta is just brutal against this deck. Against any deck, really. Being able to scry every turn. And he gets to flip it. Uh, not next turn. Unless he uses a spell here. We're going to cycle this now. See if he disallows, which wouldn't make sense to me, but. Visionary Augmenter. Okay, pass the turn. Yeah, this is a terrible matchup. Tokens are really good right now, except against Control. I think Control just beats us 10 times out of 10. Just every match, every game, every matchup. I mean, we're a $100 deck, but this is a, like, $300 deck. They, think they play Scarab God, they play Torrential Gear Hulk, Search for Contas isn't cheap, Fatal Push isn't cheap, Fumigate isn't cheap, all these dual lands aren't cheap. Just, and we know that it's gonna be Torrential Gear Hulk here, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Anointer Priest, I'd rather just have Ixalan's Binding up, so let's just go to combat. Draw out this Torrential Gear Hulk. Get in for three more. I, I guess if we could shut down Torrential Gear Hulk. That's decent. Oh, please play Torrential. I'm really betting on him playing Torrential Gear Hulk here. And he didn't? Wow. That's actually really bad for us. So I guess we... What? We anointed Procession here? Draw out a counter. Does he have a counter in his sideboard? He does. So let's just go Visionary Augmenter. Oh, we gotta, we gotta try, man. Ah, oh, no, that means he's got it. Ugh. I am so confused on what to do right now. I haven't played against. I mean, I've just haven't played against Control at all recently, and it's just throwing me for a loop. What I need to play here. If I play Visionary Augmenter. I am so confused. Maybe you just go Anointer Priest. And that's it. I don't want to get censored by a Torrential Gear Hulk and just get blown out of the water. Is this where he drops Torrential Gear Hulk? Yeah. Okay. Did we play around it? No, we didn't. Or we did, but he didn't have it, apparently. So we could have played Anointed. Nah. Now he's got cards upon cards upon cards upon cards upon cards. He's got at least two draws a turn if he wants to. Here comes what? Approach of the second sun. Ah, it's this type of control. All right. We might be dead in two or three turns here. He's tapped out, which is good for us. Play the planes. Get in for what? Four? And playing Anointed Procession here is just too slow, right? Uh, let's make sure we attack it with everybody. That'd be pretty smart to do. Okay. He takes it, obviously. Can't do anything else. If he just has another one in his hand, we lose. There's no point in playing Visionary Augmenter here. It doesn't set up lethal. Yeah. Yeah. No way Procession's going to resolve. And we pass the turn back to him. Ether Hub enters. Don't really know why he needs energy in this deck. Maybe he's got Confiscation Coup. Is this second one? Fumigate. Okay. Buying himself some turns. So our removal is not really doing anything, which is unfortunate. Another planes. Let's play it. One, two, three, four. We just got to hope this resolves. All right. Supreme Will beats us here. Is this Supreme Will? Disallow. Yeah, that's game. Okay. So let's go to the sideboard here. And we concede it there, but 
no matter what we draw, he's just going to have answers. So what do we have here for this matchup? Nothing, really. We could bring in... Um, it's a decommissions. Do they not... There we go. Decommission. Decommission for um, both Torrential Gear Hulk and Search for Oscanta. Go down probably... What? Removal? Go down maybe... Life gain isn't important to us, so let's go down to Anointer Priests. And try it like this. Man, this is this just is an ultimate feels bad. This is a feels bad matchup, man. Yep, I'd like to go first. This is a keep. Okay. Nothing till turn three, which is bad against control, but a catcher's monument, if it resolves, can help win us the game, so. Yep, pass the turn. Tap land, K, 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 pass. Visionary Augmenter is an eh. And we pass. Come on, buddy. This matchup all comes down to not even us, right? We can play around counters, we can play around removal, we can play around sweepers all we want, but it really just comes down to him not having the resources he needs or just missing land drops. If he does one of those two, they'll most likely win. And this deck is built around really hitting all those things. I'm pretty sure this deck plays opt just for some of that. So, passes, leaves up a counter. Well, if you got negate, you got negate or sensor. But we just, we gotta go for it. We gotta try to rush him. He's thinking about whether he should do it. He lets it resolve. Okay. It's interesting if he actually had a counter there or not. Because I feel like Oketra's Monument is a pretty big card. Let's just play our bigger cards, you know, quicker. Sun Scorch Champion. Interesting. Interesting indeed. That's a pretty good card against tokens, that's for sure. So we could play Visionary Augmenter here. We can also play Master Trinketeer. We can't play Anointed Processions. Let's just go Visionary Augmenter. Okay. 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 Get the servos. And pass the turn. All right, we just put four creatures out. What do you got? Ether Hub. Gets an energy that I don't know why that deck needs Ether Hub. I guess for fixing, but the deck's already pretty good at fixing. I don't know. It looks like he's passing. We get Desert Holds this just so it's out of the way. All right. A land's pretty big here. Anointed Procession plus Oketra's Monument means we can rebuild the board really quickly. Um, let's just go to combat. God, if he if he counters Anointed Processions, I'm gonna be fairly upset. Go to combat. Attack with everybody. He's gonna block the two one. We're gonna get in for three. Oops. Gotta stop getting these notifications while I'm recording. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. Get him for three. He's done a 19. Second main. He might be looking to Glimmer Genius here. He also, he's gotta have a counter, right? He's just gotta. But we gotta go for it. I think not. We gotta just play it. This is, and he lets it resolve. Okay, it definitely doesn't have a counter. He might be like, okay, I could let Oketra's Monument slide, but I think Anointed Processions is a must-have in this deck. Okay, yeah, I was right. Glimmer Genius. Looking for some answers. So now we have our kind of token generator out. You know, Oketra's, every time we play something, every time we just cast a creature, we're going to get two free 1-1s. One so there we go. Regal Caracal, kind of ex exactly what I expected. That's going to get Ixalan's Binding. 
but uh, maybe, yeah, Ixalan's Binding. Just so he can't play it anymore. Okay. Does he get in for two? If he does, ooh, thank you for attacking. That is oh so awesome of you to do. Second main. Passes. Christ, it's Sunmare. We don't have any life gain out. Uh, we, can, we can't, man. We gotta just Ixalan. We gotta Ixalan's binding this. Get, get rid of Regal Caracal. I, I can't deal with that card. It's a pretty good answer, if you ask me. These trade one for one with the cats, but I'm okay with that. We can rebuild our board. Okay. I expect a block here and a block there. Yep. Seems fair to me. All right. Crested Sunmare is really good like if it could stay out it's a just bomb card if he passes here i'm gonna be kind of upset i want him to keep playing things so i don't have to worry about counter spells but he didn't have counter spells for the anointed procession but i guess he glimmered so he could probably head into it i don't know man we could play tinketeer into artisan let's try it Tinketeer. Okay. I should always I should hit auto yield on this a catcher's monument. I don't need to respond to it. We're gonna get two free tokens. Right here. And they're all my things are gonna be two twos. Alright, he's gonna counter. Alright, I'm glad to get counters out of his hands. We still get two free tokens. Oh wait, they're not servos. That's right. A catcher's monument doesn't make servos. Then we Clint Sleeve Artisan. Get two more 1-1s. One create. Oh, now we create two servos. All right, we got an army now, boys. We got a, a massive army. But we only can get in for one right now, unfortunately for us. If he attacks with his Sun Scorch Champion, which I don't think he will, we just let it through. Like, we don't need a triple block it and let him gain a whole bunch of life back. All right, it might be Fumigate here, but in that case, I think we're okay. Just passes. Okay, makes sense. Okay. We draw planes, which is good if he has sensor. So let's just go straight to combat. Get in with everything. Might be Settle the Wreckage here, which is good for us, I think. I think it's non-tokens. Yeah, this is Settle the Wreckage. Ugh. Okay. 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 How many? How many of these do? For each for exile, that player may search his land for, for that many basic lands. Correct for this. Oh my god. You're going to get all the lands out of my deck right now. <laughs> Let me. I got to zoom this up to see which ones I'm selecting. That's like all, <laughs> it's all my stuff. All right, it's got to be Crested Sunmare. Two, three, four. It's time, boys. It's time. Please let it resolve. Let it resolve. Yes. Wait. Yes. It's vulnerable. We got one turn, but Desert's Hold gets us with that life gain. Oh, come on, baby. No removal, which I know he's got, right? He's got to have, like, an exile spell for this. Here it comes. Sunscorch champion, not quite. We need a something. We need a life gain. We only have life gain here. Not going to attack. And he's passing. Look at all this land we have now. Feels good. Okay, let's go. One, two, three. Go deserts, hold on that. Oh, we don't have a desert. I f Ultimate feels bad. We don't have life gain. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Oops, lele froops. Oops, de le froops. That's a punt. P U N T. If I've ever seen one. Go to combat. Get in with our creatures. Ah, we played eight deserts. We haven't drawn one of them yet. 
Chumps makes sense, I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Then go. He has five cards. What's the chance he has Fumigate? We play one of these, but we don't play both. Just so we can rebuild. Okay. Okay. Servo. There we go. And our board's rebuilt. <laughs> well, I mean, it's been rebuilt. God, I really wish we had a desert there. He's going to fatal push his own guy. Makes sense. He wants that life gain, boy. Is that what he's doing? Is he eternalizing? He has one, two, three, four, five, six. So he can. One more tap. Ah, he's leaving up a two. Okay. The eternalize is only five or is it four? Yeah, I can't I can't really see. I'm not close to my screen. And I don't really play with Sunscorch Champion, so. Okay. He's got a four four, whatever. Okay. Master Trinket tier needs to be played beforehand. So let's do it. Let's get it done. Okay. Okay. Go to combat. Attack, 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 attack. That's a lot of dudes. Okay. He goes to block. Blocks our fabricate guy. We get through. He's down to 10. And we pass. And we can create two guys with this. Okay, hold on. I'm readjusting my chair. Sorry if you can hear my mic moving away from my face. All right, we're back. Okay. This is the first time he's casting it. If he's got another one in hand, we're in trouble. End step. One, two, three, four. One, two. One, two, three, four. Alrighty. Okay. Untap. Another Catcher's Monument we don't need. Do we have lethal? Probably not. Let's just go to combat. Attack, 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 attack. Send everyone. He might have to chump Crested Sunmare. Yeah. Does that keep him alive? Yes! I pro... I mean, 12. Yeah, okay. Woo! Okay, okay. I think we got a good plan. He brought in the... Saving Grace. Not gonna help. Anointer Priest. Probably gotta bring back Anointer Priest and go down a Sunmare? Go down a... What? Go down a... Okay, we need all these cards. We, uh, maybe go down to Legions? We haven't really drawn it. It's not really going to help us in this deck. At least right now. Alright. So, there we go. At least we took a game. Honestly, thought we were going to get swept there. But, tokens can be good if they don't keep getting sweepers. Ooh. Oh, this is a good hand if we drew one land. Just one. Just one. We're going to keep. We're going to get We're gonna get a little bit greedy. But I th think it's worth it. I think. That's the key word. Uh, okay. 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 We draw not a land. Play Desert of the True. At least we have a desert out now. So our desert holds are actually going to do stuff. All right. He plays Ether Hub. Getting that energy. Getting that mana fixing a little bit. All right. Goes to combat. Skips combat. And my turn. There's another Desert of the True. We play this and then go tap, tap, Anointer Priest. Sensor. Okay. That's fine. <clears throat> I'd rather have that censored than my four drops up here. Getting a Desert of the True is a little bit annoying. That means we have to play another Anointer Priest, but, uh, you know, whatever. All right, what has he got? He 
plays the tap land. And skips his turn. All right, at least he can't counter anything. Which would be, I would say, yeah. It's unfortunate that this is a tap land. Goes to end step. Sitting on end step. Okay. Oh, Ketra's Monument, though. See, this is... Mm, I was going to say, if we draw a Ketra's Monument when he can't counter anything, I'm going to be very upset. And we can't because we have to play a tap land. Ultimate feels bad moment. It's, it's kind of weird. I guess he censors that, right? Makes... Uh, I don't know. I would have saved it. And Anointed Priest doesn't... He, he isn't on the plan of beating me down to death. He's on the plan of winning with Approach the Second Son. I don't think that censor on my Anointed Priest is right. But we'll see. All right. We have we have Rain here to play a Catcher's Monument, which is good. Which is really good. So, it's not going to get countered. Feel a little bit better. And he's going to pass. We draw Ixalan's Binding. Well, that's not any of my concern here. All right. He is doing some. I'm not going to attack with my guy. A 1-3 is nice, though. I think this is a 1-3. I, mean, I should really pay more attention to my own cards and my own decks. This 1-3. Okay. He's at 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 mana. So he's 2 mana ahead of us. Leaves everything up, which is a... It's a feels bad moment. Another desert of the true man. We gotta play it, right? A play it. Okay. He's got a counter, right? So we a Ketra or do we visionary augmenter? I think we just Oketra. No, Ketra's good. I think we visionary augmenter here. Okay. No anointed processions out right now. Okay, he's going to counter it. Supreme Will. Makes sense. Okay, we gain a life. We get a creature. Okay. Begin. Skip combat. Don't want to attack into a 2-3. Doesn't make sense. Okay. Got a, got a counter out of his hand. He's down to three cards. We have four cards, except we're only at four mana. Here comes Cast Out on Gross. He's going to cast out what? A Catcher's Monument? Okay. Makes sense, I guess. The question is... Oh. Do we go a Catcher plus Legion's Landing? Oh, we can't. Oops. We can go Decommission, though. Let's go to Combat. Right? Then we Decommission and Legion's Landing. Yeah. Okay. He blocks this. We get in for one. And then maybe he fatal pushes this. But, we, you know. All right. This is an old trick I used to do. I used to play a revolt deck against my friends. And I would make really stupid attacks. And they'd be really confused and thought, hey, what, what are you doing? I'm like, I'm trying to get revolt. <laughs> yeah, you went for it. Okay. Second main. We go tap, tap, tap. For <laughs> decommission. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing this card. Whether you like it or not. Alright, and Legion's Landing. Get a 1-1 lifelinker out. Now our horse. If we can draw a Crested Sunmare. Fatal push. Okay. Alright, he's down to one card. He's going to have two cards here. As long as he doesn't draw into Glimmer, we should win this game. We should just win it. All right, we got a removal for whatever he throws at us. I'm going to be really psyched if we can beat Esper Approach. It's kind of surprising to me they haven't played like a Scarab God yet. I feel like that's a card you just, you just got to play in control decks. All right, he's passing. Oh my god, we drew our fourth one. Do we play it? One, two, three. Yeah, we got to play it. No, no, we don't. We can't. We can't, my boy. We cannot. Okay. Oketra's, Oketra's dropping right now. 
How much do these cost to get back? Three. No, he got a counter. No, really? Disallow. God, I was so sure that was going to resolve. Okay, sure. <laughs> I'm upset about it, but yeah. What's this embalm cost? Four. Okay. And we don't need to use Desert of the True. Nah, we do. Let's play it. Okay. Pass. We need one more guy so we can flip Legion's Landing. Cycles, wow. So we had a counter plus something. Wow, that's really good for him. I think Glimmer is the best card he could have had, but that's pretty pretty close to the best combo he could have had. And a counter that, man, after all that, I really thought Oketra was going to stick. I mean, what else am I saying? I can't just not play a catcher there, right? I just have to assume out of the two cards, one of them isn't a hard counter. And he just had it. He just had it. All right, he's holding. Once we get this Legion's landing going off, we should be okay. Oops. We're down to eight minutes on our time, but that's not going to be a problem, I think. Okay, he's holding up. He has one card. One card in hand. It could be a land. Let's save Artisan. Pretty good. Do we get back Anointer Priest, though? Probably. We're one short of doing both. Let's just go Anointer Priest. Embalm Anointer Priest. It resolves. We gain a life. And we pass. Next turn, we're swinging with the crew. If he doesn't remove any of them. Just so we can flip Legion's Landing. Which actually is important right now. Because we could use both the, the land tapping and the token creating. He Don't say you got Glimmer, man. Okay, he's got more cycling. So he drew two lands. Cycling is bad, though. It means he oh, it cycles more. And passes. Or, yeah. Now it's his turn. Here comes Regal Caracal. Ooh, but I got Ixalan's Binding. <laughs> I got the answer for it again. <laughs> All right, passing. Chef at Dunes is pretty good. That's definitely a play. We have all deserts out. <laughs> this is so stupid. Okay, add this. Okay, two, three, four. Excellence binding. I mean, he's just gonna ha has to let it resolve. He, uh, fatal push would be bad here. Pre-combat fatal push. If he can pick it up. Begin combat. Oh, shoot. He might triple block this Anointer Priest. Flip Legion's landing. Alright, go to town. Is he going to triple block it? Yeah, or double block it? That's a feels bad moment. Uh, sign that. I gotta, I gotta move it physically. There we go. Yep. I should have played my dude pre-combat. That's a punt. Let's leave Artisan. Gonna get another dude. Okay. 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 Servo. Okay. All right. This could be sacrificed next turn if we want to. Is this any desert? Sacrifice a desert. That's good. Approach of the second sun. We're in trouble. No. Not really. We're seven turns away from trouble. <laughs> if he top decks this like another one, I'm going to be, again, upset. So. What do we draw? Another Chefette Dunes. So let's go Chefette Dunes. How much does this cost? Pay five. Or is that four? Four. Pay four. Pay four. So we can go one, two, one, two, three. Oh, we have to tap this too, huh? Yeah, so it's basically paying five. One, two, three, four, five. Sacrifice this. Okay. Um, do we do can we do it again? No. Alright. Go to combat. Get in with everybody. This Sunscorch champion is really good against us. 
I guess we could have deserts holded it, which probably makes sense, but oh well. Gets the life linker out of the way. Okay. Pass. It also doesn't mean we can create. This takes three to create something. He top decks a land. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Come on. Pass. You're not going to attack. Don't try to fool me. I cannot be fooled. So that's kind of... I think that's a little bit of a punt, right? Not... You know, sometimes I make so many decks, I'm going to end up punting with these decks. Like, it's just... It's just what I do. It's just what I do. Desert's hold. I mean, he's got to let it resolve. All right. So then we can go one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Sacrifice the desert. Get my guys plus one, plus one. All right, go to combat. Get in for a bunch. Okay. Okay. Knock them down to 15. All right. Now we're both off top decks. Is his top decks better than mine? We'll see. We top deck Master Trinketeer. We can go one, two, three. Then we can also go one, two, three. Okay. We can create this, right? This costs three. Okay. One, two, three. Master. We the reason we do this now is just so we can get in more damage. Oh, wait. Okay. How do we untap one of these? God damn it. That doesn't matter. Go to combat. What you got? What you got? What you got? Get in for a bunch, which means five. All right, we're on a clock. How many turns until he draws this thing? I think it's four right now, or th five. I think it's four. No cycle. No cycle, no draw spell. So he's at three now. Nothing. Oh, if he top deck set of the wreckage, I'm going to be upset. He's speaking. Oh, no. Mm, uh, mm, 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 punt. You know I like punting. Do I have lethal with this? Is this sorcery speed only? God damn it. God damn it. I am bad at this game. I am so bad. He's got set of the wreckage. Holy crap. What a top deck. Well, that hurts. That really hurts. That's a lot of things. One, two, three. Visionary Augmenter. Oh my god. Uh, he said, okay, Cycles. Oh, he's got it. Yeah, that's game. Dang it, man. Settle the wreckage. He had... I was just thinking in my head. I didn't say it out loud. I'm like, if he top deck settle the wreckage, I'm going to be so upset. Oh, boy. Oh, man. Yeah. yeah. So those punts I had didn't even matter with the plus one to everybody and get an extra thing from that. Would have been lethal if he didn't have settle the wreckage, but he did. Like... Wow. That is, uh, is he tapping? He's got a hat. I think he's got it. Yeah. Oh, he doesn't. Uh, now he's got, oh, we have, you're telling me there's a chance. There is a chance. He doesn't have enough mana. Oh boy. Uh, we got back a Sun Scorch champion. Rip. Rip me. Rip this game. Uh, 
Doug. I, I thought we were going to have it. He's got to have it. It's His other card is the... Is it? Oh, wait. Sunscore. Oh, he didn't eternalize it. I thought... Okay. Main... Come on. You can skip your main phase. Wow, this is a really long game, but... Uh, what you got? Okay. Get a 1-1. One, one. We top deck, not anything useful. Is there a way we can, like, widen this so I can see? Does it the true Ketra? We can get back Anoint our Priest, but does that matter? Let's go. One, two, three, four. Sacrifice the Desert. We shouldn't have tapped that. Tap that. Get it on the floor. All right, go to combat. Attack, 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 attack. Yep. Do we have lethal there? God, I'm bad at this game. Down to four. We had lethal. No! <laughs> I hate myself. Dude, I am so bad at this game. I am actually terrible. No, not concede. Maybe, maybe on accident he... Uh... Okay, let's go. Anointer Priest. One, two, three, four... Okay. One, two. Okay. Damn it. I am just god awful at this game, dude. Just, just awful. Servo. We're going to lose at 35 life. God, I hate myself. Ugh, if I would have just not, if I would have just thought it through. Like, I just, uh, oh. if I would have just thought this game through, we would have won. We would have won. And that's game. What is it? What are we, what are we waiting on you for? Uh, we would have played Desert's Hold earlier. We would have won if we would have done, yeah, that's it. Uh, that's I'm gonna count that as a win all right with anybody that's competent and knows how to play the game of magic even remotely well you win you win that game right I punted twice we had it where I didn't play uh no that would only gotten us in for what two more damage that would have won all right if, if I would have seen that I could have done the uh double pump twice and just one right there then we I would have won right so that's a major punt god dang it okay well anyway thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed that painful painful game three but yeah i'll see you in the next one